Hi, this is Mark Kemper with EMS, and in this video, we're going to check out our new 3D scanning productivity kit. All right, so to get started, let's talk about why we built this kit. Well, if you've seen any of our videos, you may have noticed through the years, we've been developing new and better ways of helping us do our 3D scanning with some different tools to hold the parts and for targeting and for our PC uh, laptop and things like that. And so we went out and we worked with a local manufacturer and we had them build stuff and we, we iterated it and changed it. Uh, we've made some videos where you see this stuff in the videos and we've had such a demand for us to actually start making these for our customers. Uh, we decided to partner up with that local manufacturer and uh, be able to put together some kits that we are now going to be selling um, you know, to our customers or really anybody doing 3D scanning, uh, this kit uh, is available. It doesn't really matter what scanner you're using, what type, what brand, this, this theoretically will work with all scanners. So I'm just gonna go through and break down what we're offering because we're gonna have some different options for you, what's included in the kits and what you can buy on your own. All right, so let's take a look uh, closer here at the kit and, and what your different options are. Uh, the heart of the kit is these rotary tables, turntables, Lazy Susans, whatever you want to call them. We're offering them in a 26 inch and 19 inch size, so depending on the size of your parts. They are on a commercial heavy, heavy duty bearing, um, which will hold a few hundred pounds uh, of weight on these. The, the plates themselves are 3 8 uh, high quality aluminum. And then on the plates, every one inch are threaded holes. And you can, uh, we can make these in both uh, metric uh, M6 or uh, standard uh, quarter 20. Um, so depending on, because a lot of people already have some other fixturing, if they have a CMM, they may have a lot of fixture um, uh, components. Uh, that would all work with this in the correct size. Um, but you've got the plate, you've got all the threaded holes um, uh, on these. They'll have a handle, which makes it easy to lift it up and carry it around. Um, there's rubber feet on the bottom side of the bearing uh, when you put it down. So the idea here, if you've seen any of our videos, is having all these threaded holes lets us add components for targeting and for holding the part. So what's going to come with the kit is uh, six, uh, six inch bars, six 10 inch and six 14 inch bars. And the idea here is you'll add targets to these bars. Now, we're not putting the targets on them because different scanners use different targets. Okay, so whether you use contrast or retro reflective, three mil, six mil, whatever it may be, um, you have these bars and the idea is you'll put them on all sides of the bars and then you thread the bar into the table and then when you're uh, scanning your part, especially when you're moving around up down, you'll be able to see those targets. So you'd put as many bars as you need. Now one thing we're going to add that we uh, uh, already got a suggestion on is putting a threaded hole in the top so that we'd be able to thread two bars together and make it even taller. Um, so we'll be adding that um, uh, to these so that you just get more versatility uh, out of the bars themselves. So you'll have the, <clears throat> so what comes standard is the, is the, the turntable of size and then the included uh, bars. And of course you could buy more of them if you want. And then if you want to put like targets on your table or something, um, you can use anything you want. Theoretically, you could just put the stickers right on the table. We tend not to do that. They get kind of beat up and depending on the scanner you use, and you may want them or may, you may want. But you could use any kind of artifacts. These are not included. Um, you can 3D print this file. We'll share this file with you. But if you want some uh, targets down on the table, um, you can just use whatever you want, any kind of artifacts with targets on it. And then uh, an option with this is going to be a fixture kit. And that's going to be standard, you know, uh, uh, like I mentioned, CMMs. So there's lots of CMM fixture kits out there. And the idea behind those is this gives you a way to, you know, maybe thread um, these into the table to, you know, hold a part up off the table a little bit, um, you know, that type of thing. So you could put some of the, those in there. Um, here's um, a, a bar where, you know, you can use these different clamps to, um, you know, hold something in place. So it gives you a lot of versatility and we'll show you some samples of using some of this fixture kit stuff uh, with it to hold parts in, in different scenarios. Um, so that's what comes with the basic kit is the turntable and the bars. Then you can add the, uh, the fixturing kit itself um, to hold your parts if you want. 
Um, and then also you can buy, uh, there's other things out there. And again, we'll show, um, we'll show some of this here in some examples where different clamps and different uh, uh, helpers, uh, kind of arms and stuff with clamps on them, depending on the types of parts uh, that you, you have. Now, another option you're gonna have is this PC stand here. So if you're doing a lot out on the shop floor and you've got a laptop, um, you know, these laptops are pretty expensive nowadays, so it's important that you have a good laptop and good secure setup. Uh, we're having this custom fabricated. It's got a strap to hold your laptop. It's got straps to hold your cables. It's got a spot over here for your mouse, um, and, it, and it mounts to a, a heavy-duty Benro uh, tripod, which is also included, and it all breaks down, makes it super portable, um, but gives you a lot of security when you're out on the shop floor. Um, and you want to make sure you're, you, it's easy to work on your PC and it's secure. It's a ball head style, so it gives you a lot of uh, flexibility in moving it and adjusting it to the angle you want so you can work. So this is going to be another option for you is the, uh, the tripod here like you see for your laptop. Okay, so this wraps up our video on our new 3D scanning productivity kit. Uh, if you want to learn more about this, I'm going to have some links in the description below. Um, and we can send you more information and pricing on these kits. Um, they're built to order, so there's a little bit of a lead time. We've got a little bit of stock, uh, but depending on how quick they sell, um, there may be some lead time on, on getting these built, but it's fairly quick, and um, we can get them out to you, and you can use them, and we find them extremely helpful uh, for holding our parts so they don't move around. We're gonna get better accuracy. We're gonna be able to scan the parts faster. Um, it's just something we use every day, and we found it so helpful and our customers liked it so much, we, we decided, hey, let's go ahead and share this. Let's get some made and get them out and let people uh, enjoy them. And hopefully it'll help them out with, with any 3D scanning, whether it's reverse engineering or inspection. These are a great tool to have in your shop or even take out to a customer site.